Hi guys, my name is Fiona James and welcome to The Sims Castaway Stories. I am so excited about playing this game. I love old school Sims so much. I just can't wait. I don't think I've ever played this. I think maybe I've played it for like half an hour or so, but I've never actually really played it like right through. I don't think I've played any of the stories right through to be honest. So I'm excited for this. So we have a couple of options. Learn to play. We won't learn to play. We have shipwrecked and single. Or we have one mummy island. Um, shipwrecked and single. Very little is known about this remote tropical paradise. Its location isn't recorded on any chart or map. Wild animals prowl its dense jungles from the ominous volcanic crater to the wide sandy beaches. Lost and alone, can you survive long enough to find other castaways and meet island natives? I hope so. Let's, should we play that? Yeah, let's play that one. Oh, would you like to play a quick tutorial? Uh, no, thank you. I wouldn't. Oh, we have options of, we could be David Bennett. Or we could be Jessica Knight. So let's have a little read of their story. So David Bennett. Sailing the world on the crew of a luxury yacht has been rewarding but lonely. Could that be about to change? The captain just announced that the ship is heading for shore leave at Meet Your Mate, the hottest singles resort in the world. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to meet the love of your life. Or, Jessica Knight. Yesterday you were trapped in the daily grind back in Sim City. Today you're on your way to the hottest singles resort in the world to do a story for Going Places magazine. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity and not just for your writing career. Somewhere out there you're determined to find your own special someone. Or we can create a new family. Right, let's go. I think we're going to go with Jessica Knight. So let's be Jessica Knight. <gasps> Loading, shipwreck and single. So excited. Loading the Knight family. Oh, look at the boat that they're on. Oh. Is this the shipwreck? There's no image. I love how there's no image for it. It's just a black screen. Good sound. They couldn't even be bothered. <laughs> oh no! The ship sank. Oh, it's Jessica <laughs> floating to shore. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh, whoa, look at the fire. Oh, we've arrived. We're shipwrecked. Washed up on the island. Two days later. Okay. She's just been lying there for two days. Oh. What happened? Oh, chapter one, almost paradise. Okay, so maybe I. Oh, that looks like my cruise ship. I, I remember boarding. It was empty. I was tired. I fell asleep and woke up here. Others obviously boarded the ship at some point. Did they make it? Could they be here? I can't think about that now. Where am I? This place doesn't look like any of the pictures in the brochure of Club Meet Your Mate. No, it doesn't. What's that over there? Oh, you can click the goal icon for any time for more information about how to progress story goals. Okay, so our goal at the moment is get the hatchet. Okay. So let's click on the hatchet and pick that up. So we've got goal and we've got wants as well. Get a rainwater tower, that'll be handy. Oh, yay! A hatchet. I hope this will come in handy. I wonder what else is washed up. Of course a hatchet is going to come in handy. Oh, what have we spotted? <gasps> oh, treasure. I'll walk the beach and look for anything else that might be useful. I'll call this place 
Felicity Island. Surely nothing bad can happen in a place with a name like Felicity. What makes you think that, um, Jessica? So, let's go and dig out this thing. Is that the only thing along the beach? I think maybe it is. So our goal at the moment is to find more stuff, which we are doing. Go, Jessica. What's she found? It's a steamer trunk from the ship. The steamer trunk you have just picked up is now in your rewards inventory. Press the rewards button at any time during the game to examine, add or remove items from your infantry. Okay, there's our infantry. So we have got... Oh, it won't let me click. Okay, placing the steamer... Oh, I have to click on it. Click on the steamer trunk. It won't let me click. Oh, hang on, I have to continue. Place the steamer trunk on a flat section of the ground where you would like to set up your camp. If it's green, I can place it, okay? Click on the live mode after you place... Okay, I can do that. So click on the infantry. Ah, so we can't place it on like a wonky bit. We have to place it where it's flat. Oh, up here, away from the sea, surely. Can I turn it round? I'd like to turn it round. How do I... Ah, like... I don't know. Let, let's just let's just place it. Okay, it's it's down. Now we'll go into live mode. And do we want to go in? You can click the story mode icon at any time to read your journal entries. Ooh, we've got a little journal. I'm so lonely. I know. I'll write in my diary when it gets too bad. It beats talking to myself all day and night. Oh, so we haven't. Oh, almost paradise. Oh yeah, we have a little. Oh, let's read this. I found a hatchet on the beach. I have a feeling I'll need anything and everything that I can get my hands on to survive in this island. I picked it up. Of course I get shipwrecked on my first exotic getaway. I knew I should have flown. It's okay. At least I have my health and a hatchet. What more could I possibly need? Note to self. Sarcasm helps. Waste not, want not. I combed the beach for anything that might be useful, like a travel agent. <laughs> Instead, I found a steamer trunk from my ship buried on the beach. That means there could be more things from the ship scattered around the island. Too bad this trunk isn't big enough to ride out of here. My luggage is probably empty, or worse, filled with poisonous snakes. I can put the trunk in my camp. It's sort of the centrepiece in my furnishings right now. Actually, it's my only furnishings. The steamer trunk will have to wear many hats for the time being. It's the only place I can store my stuff. What stuff? I need some stuff. Oh, that's a little journal entry. Bless her. Right, how do we, we haven't got any gold at the moment, right, okay, uh, this trunk will be a great place to keep my supplies, I need supplies, speaking of supplies, I'm parched, I need something to drink, a good stiff juice would be great about now, can we open this, right, oh, is this, there's nothing in there, is there not, let's, let's just take a little look and see. Nah, no, study. Oh, we can study cooking from here. Mechanical and cleaning. Okay. Check food levels. Current level, zero. <laughs> we have no food. Okay, let's close the chest up. We have, we should see if we can, well, what's this? Use. Is it bamboo? Or sugar cane? I don't know. Oh no, she's going to the toilet. Is she going to the toilet? She is. I thought she was going to like, I don't know, gather some, I don't know. Oh, drink coconut juice. Oh, let's drink some coconut juice. She said she was thirsty. Oh, what I wouldn't give. If she can climb that, she has got some. We should surely have to learn to do that first. Jessica, how have you managed to be able to climb up a coconut tree? Having never been on an exotic island. Oh, I would love some coconut right now. Oh, delicious. Oh, 250. That must have been... I don't know where... Oh, there we go. Look, that had gone in. Okay. Collect coconuts is the goal at the moment. 
that hit the spot. I should get some more for later. So can we gather? Let's gather coconuts then. Excellent. They are some skills. I am so impressed, Jessica. It's a miracle. Oh, look, three coconuts. Did she just put them straight into the box, maybe? Whew, that's hard work for a snack. Like, it is, yeah. <laughs> she enjoys coming down, though, I think. Oh, hang on, where have we gone? Um, at least I have some supplies. A fire will be essential to my survival here. I need to chop some wood. Oh, okay, it was taking us to the wood. So our goal now is to gather wood. We're doing it. Where is that wood? Where's Jessica? Oh, she's coming. Oh, there's bits of wood over here as well. Look, let's chop that up. And none of these plants, I thought more of these plants might, might have some nice fruit on or something. Ooh, look. Handy that that hatchet was there, right? <laughs> you can check how many resources your sim has by looking at the resource counter indicated by the... Oh, okay. So down here in the bottom left corner. Time to put this wood to good use. Now that you've collected some resources, you can start using them to make different objects. Open barter mode to see what you can make. The more resources you collect, the more objects you can create. Ooh, this sounds interesting. So, barter mode. Ah, so we've got a fire. A cooking space. What's this? Leaf pile. So, oh, they just use supplies as general supplies. It's not an individual items. Oh, okay. So, what's this one? The ash grabber. Um, so, do you think it makes any difference? Which, are these just both? Let's, okay, let's just build this one. Beginner's model. We'll, we'll build this fire. Where did we put? I'm a bit lost. Okay, what about we'll just set up camp? I feel like we shouldn't do it just on. Yeah, we'll just do it here, right on the beach. It's fine. Not too close to the plants. We'll place that down. That looks good to me. Oh, we can light the fire, yeah. Chop that bit of wood as well. And, oh, let's examine what that is. After we've done that, we'll go and examine. Oh, our goal is to light a fire. We should we should light our fire then, if that's what she wants to do. Okay, light fire. Finish chopping that wood up first, and then we'll just go and examine what this is. I need something to cut this bamboo with. I bet a machete would work. We have not got a machete at the moment, Jessica, so you'll just have to leave it for now. Go and light your fire. She, her social is going down fast. No, no surprise, really, right? She's skilled. She can just light a fire with two rocks. I did it! I have rediscovered a fire. <laughs> She's crazy. Crazy lady. Okay. Oh! That scared me. <laughs> oh great. I need to make some type of shelter. You do. Um, build a shelter. So let's have a little look. Shelter is 20. Oh, that's okay. We've got 20. We can choose different colours as well. Oh, this is just wonderful. Should we go for, let's go for like the brown one to blend in with nature. I don't want to sleep right on the beach. Can we sleep back here a little bit? It's not letting me put it down anywhere. Apart from there, I don't like it there though. I don't know why, I don't know why I object to that space. Let's just put it there actually. Can I turn it? Nope. No, I'd like to look out to see, actually. Yeah, that'll be fine. That's fine there. 
I'm happy with it like that. We should move the fire over to sleep. Hang on, hang on. Let me just move the fire over to where we're sleeping. That makes more sense. Okay. Um, I should get some sleep. It's not like I'm going to miss out on a raging party. No, you're not. Oh, so now her goal, her goal, her goal is to get some rest. Oh, sit or lounge. We're not tired enough. Let's warm up. Oh, warm up by the fire. Let's see what she does. Oh, Very resourceful, isn't she? Where's our... No, energy. The energy isn't down. Oh, there we go. Sleep. Now it is. Don't we like to leave our fire on overnight? Oh, good night, Jessica. First night on the island. Oh, she's a snorer. Oh. <gasps> Something's watching us. Oh, it's an ape. A monkey. Are they coming to steal our food, our coconuts? We didn't we didn't get any bananas. Stay away from us. <sighs> they best not steal the whole chest. I'll be gutted if they do. Literally, <laughs> the monkey. Oh no, poor Jessica. <gasps> oh, chapter two. We did chapter one in the first episode. It makes sense to me to do chapter two in the second episode. So I am going to end it here. But I am loving this. So, so loving this. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know down below what you think of this series. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you soon for a new video. Thanks for watching. Bye.